Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're doing a three-day Itzy diet challenge to celebrate the release of their English album. For this diet challenge, I've actually taken the healthiest Itzy meal preferences from an interview they did with Harper's Bazaar of what they eat in a day and made them into a full meal plan schedule. I like to eat salad. I eat cherry tomatoes a lot and I try not to eat after 8 p.m. For breakfast, like most Itzy members, I'm gonna be drinking cold water and eating fresh fruit. For lunch, I'm cooking sautéed vegetables like Ryujin. And for dinner, I'm ending with chicken salad like Yuna and Yeji. And if I ever get hungry throughout the day, my go-to snack will be cherry tomatoes, which Leah loves. As a final rule, courtesy of Yuna, we're also not gonna be eating after 8 p.m. If you want to follow along, complete with meal prep ingredients, full recipes, and suggested workouts, the diet schedule is now available for all patrons on my Patreon linked in the description down below. When I wake up, I really prefer to drink very cold water with ice. So I normally take some fruits or smoothies out. Day one, it's 10 a.m. now, and we're having some breakfast. Cold water and some fruit. All right, y'all, it is now two o'clock. I have lasted this long on just that water and bowl of fruit, but now I'm about to have my lunch. I just did a filming session, so I also got my dance workout in for the day. Um, let's go eat. It's a fried vegetables with cabbage and mushroom and onion, green onion. I absolutely hate cutting onions. I'm literally wearing a ski mask to stop it from getting into my eyes. Don't worry, this is not all for one meal. I'm just prepping for the next three lunches. And Ryujin's favorite. The very important thing is oyster sauce. We got some oyster sauce. So my noodle. I love cabbage, so I'm genuinely enjoying this. All right, it's now 6.30. I've just done a full day of editing and studying and checking up on YouTube, Patreon, everything. Completed everything on my checklist here. Um, so that means it is now time for dinner. For dinner, I usually eat salad and chicken breast. I usually eat salad. I like to eat salad at dinner. We actually made it just in time, guys. It's now 7.40 and I'm not planning to eat anything after 8. I try not to eat after 8 p.m. So I'm just gonna dig into the salad and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Wait, one last update. We did it, we finished the salad. It's now 7.59. <laughs> and now I'll see you tomorrow. 
Good morning, it is now day two, 11 a.m. I woke up and there is a ton of snow today. It's really cold, so I'm drinking some um, lukewarm water, not cold water. I am not super hungry and I have a bunch of errands to run and I'm not gonna be working out this morning. So I'm just gonna stick to the water today and I will see you guys back here for lunch. It is now 12.30 and I am super hungry. As soon as I left the house, I was like, dang, I really should have eaten some mixed fruit before I left. But oh well, I am about to cook lunch. So luckily I had everything prepped yesterday and we just need to cook it up. Got the cabbage and the onion and it already smells so good with soy sauce. So good, so warm, look at the steam. A few moments later. Snack time, we have some cherry tomatoes and grapes um, like Leah and Yeji like to eat. All right y'all, it's workout time. We are filming some videos, choreographing some dances, practicing and all that good stuff. So we're gonna get our dance on like Insy does every single day. <laughs> didn't really make it all pretty. It is overflowing. We're gonna finish this though. I am super hungry. Let's go. I finished it. <laughs> I am pretty full now, but I guarantee you I'm gonna be hungry tomorrow morning. So see you guys then. Day three, it is now the last day of the diet challenge. And honestly, I'm pretty looking forward to eating all of these meals. And I think I'll continue to cook them even after this challenge is over. But I do fear today will be the worst day because I got my period this morning, which means I'm just feeling really bloated, really tired. Um, I don't even know whether or not I should eat breakfast, but I'm gonna be drinking the water. We're gonna wait until lunch and see how I feel um, and decide how much I'm gonna eat that. All right, y'all, it's finally lunchtime. It's around 12.30 and I honestly can't believe I made it this far without eating. Um, but now I'm very hungry. I'm ready to cook the rest of this cabbage. I swear this never gets old. It's the soy sauce. And now we're outside. It is time for our daily exercise, taking a walk through the snow not actually too bad um, but this is part one and then I'm gonna go back in and film some videos Hello. Hello. makeup's on hair's tied up time for part two of our exercise today filming and choreographing and just for you guys who made it this far into this video here's a little sneak peek of what's coming All right, y'all, I hope you are hyped for these workouts. I am finally done with my workout for today. I have burned 300 calories and I am so hungry. I'm ready to eat dinner. It's about 6.30, so let's go cook that final meal for the Itzy diet. And that's it. This is the last time I'll be making and eating the salad at least for a little while, but I'm sure I'll return to it in the future. 
Honestly, I thought the salad was too big in the beginning, but as you can see, it was the perfect portion to last me until the next morning and the dressing was just to die for. If you want the recipe to this salad and everything else I ate in this diet challenge, from the ingredients to how to make it to the calorie count, make sure to check out the link in the description down below. It will be uploaded on my Patreon, available for all levels of patrons. All right, I'm gonna go enjoy this bad boy while watching a movie, so I will see you guys tomorrow for the final wait. Good morning guys, it is day four. We have made it to the end of the Itzy Diet Challenge and I'm so excited to see the final results. Honestly, I feel a lot better, a lot healthier, and I think I look a lot skinnier. So without further ado, here's the final results. All right guys, moment of truth, weighing myself now. Holy, 111.4. Okay, these results are super crazy. For those of you who've seen my black pink diet challenge, it's about the same weight loss I experienced there. But I don't think I've fallen under 112 pounds for a long, long time. So this diet challenge, I highly recommend. Now let's see if I can maintain this weight. All right, y'all, that's it. I hope this encourages some of you to try out this diet challenge as well. And if you want to follow along, you can find the full schedule right here on my Patreon, now available for all levels of patrons. That includes the timestamps for when I ate, when I worked out, what I ate, ingredients, recipes, as well as calorie counts. All right, thanks so much for tuning in and I'll see you guys next time.